Oh, ladies and gentlemen, once again, another production of the Anal Network. We have, uh, well, the uh, uh, Bay of Bengals up against the uh, Minnesota, Minnesota Kansas Siski Frisky 40 49ers. Yeah, we got them. The, uh, <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> that was <laughs> and the Vikings weren't even playing in that game. So, Oh, Dante Culpepper blowing up this season. Achilles Smith, well, he plays for the Bengals. Robert Smith, a much better of the two. Wait, Dillon. Dillon. Randy Moss, the dickhead who couldn't be stopped last year. Keys Carenza. The reason the Bungles are still in it. That and the fact that they haven't played yet. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> this game a lot closer than previous A lot more matchups. evenly matched, yeah. It's a lot better uh, as far as the evenness of the matchup goes. And a hush falls over the crowd for the coin toss. Bengals win the toss. They elect to fuck off. Yes, yes it is. Charge bucklers. Vikings. <laughs> <laughs> wow. <laughs> yeah, Vikings Ab pretty much <laughs> swept that whole season. Habit Costello to kick off. <laughs> Cross it up a little bit. I couldn't think of anything that Abbott Costello did. Wow. Are yeah, you having some technical an difficulties? Lack of control on the fat part of. The, never mind. Okay. He has the wrong controller. <laughs> Rosie Palmer charging back down the field <laughs> and uh, masturbating as fast as he can. Doesn't look like he's got too much of a return. Ah. <sighs> Quack, 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 quack. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> when they open their mouths like that, they look like animals. Just quack, 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 quack. That or it's just a really bad Chinese film with the voiceover comes later. It could be. I am the Kung Fu Master. I will beat the Tekken Warrior. <laughs> 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 now you sound like... You get it? Dante Culpepper back to pass. That gets broken up. Looks like he was uh, aiming for somebody who didn't catch the ball. What the hell are with those lizard eyes on Culpepper? You see those things flashing like crazy. Elder Skelter. Elder Skelter. His stupid forked tongue is actually <laughs> dripping over the face <laughs> mask. Right now. And off to Smith, who gets ass wrangled right at the line of scrimmage. Yeah, that was more than ass wrangling. That was a full on corn holing right there. <laughs> <laughs> that was, uh, oh, yeah. I. No, I. Maybe. I don't know. Nonetheless. I don't know, but the Candyman, Heath Bar, is uh, out wide looking to come around in for the sack. Cole charging, charging. Bang! Cole Pepper takes Cole Pepper it gets right in the nuts. Oh, who can Cole take Pepper a, a little disgruntled. Uh, right off Culpepper's face. Oh, man, they just totally took a nut noggin right there. <laughs> I would say it was a full facial butt to the... Uh, Never mind. <laughs> 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 anyway, it's going to look like they're going to go for the punt. Cincinnati's ready for it. First and ten. Let's punt. I think we're their own five. To receive the ball would be Warwick. Who's out oh past Wow. There is no punt coverage. Bengals in really good field position. They got the ball all the way on the 48-yard line of the Minnesota fuckfaces. And I'm thinking early in the game, you got to take it right to Keith Grant because uh, he's the one that's going to show him, going to give him, you know, the, uh, going to break edge. their spirits. Definitely going to break the other Smith spirits. back to pass, though. Deep Way drop. back to pass. Carranza <laughs> going long and decides to squat on the five just because. That was an interesting catch and uh, fall. He doesn't like to score too fast, likes to make it a bit of a game. That's okay. Oh, he didn't catch it. He dropped oh it. Oh, my God. He must have dropped it at the end. Keys. I don't know, but Corey. 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 Really? Corey. Jesus Christ. He he's all the way. He did go all the way. Bumbling, bumbling, stumbling. 47 yards. Yards per carry on his one carry. He's averaging 47 yards a carry. And strangely, the... The Cincinnati offensive strategy involves no diving before getting to any kind of mark that they need, which uh, is, is completely different from Green Bay. <laughs> usually usually they try to dive at least five times before the play is over, and uh, I know it didn't happen even once there. Cincinnati coming out with the big offense. Pelfrey, Pelfrey coming out with his own sexuality. Coming out of the closet. 
looking for the extra point. It's up and it looks like it's uh, right down the center. I realize when the play starts it says Lorxo across the screen. What the hell does that mean? <laughs> Lorxo. You gotta watch it one of these times, man. It's what it says. It was crazy. I have a, I have a new lord. Anyway. <laughs> Alrighty now. Abbott being gone, Costello is uh, getting ready to take the kick off. I'd, I'd make more fun of that, except I can't remember a single song that Elvis Costello ever did. Something with some chick's name in it. That's all I know. Kate. Twenty. Ooh, when Tater gets totted, right? He uh, doesn't get any more than he would have gotten if he had just taken a squat in the end zone. And shit a ball. We haven't decided whether that's a penalty. <laughs> <laughs> Which uh, <laughs> brings into question all sorts of homosexual things, but we'll let it all pass right now. Ross? Yeah, but ball shitting is just, I don't know. Anyway. It's more like a tampon. <laughs> Football tampon. <laughs> yeah, um, I am <laughs> so hungry. Inflatable feminine napkin. <laughs> all bumper, all pepper out to the wing. Carter. 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 Pick up the first down, I believe. Yes. Yeah, Dante looks to be a little upset about that uh, last drive that didn't go anywhere. As he yeah, adjusts his face mask. Mm. I'm sorry, I didn't even know what I was saying right there. Keith uh, Barr. The candy man can. He's coming in. da 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 -da. Da -da. Look at, oh man. Lost. Busting through car coverage. Is he as good this year as he was last year? Last year he was unstoppable. End of the first quarter, Bengals up by seven. It's looking real good for him right now. Well, they need to. Uh, Get a defensive stop here and get the second touchdown. To really pretty too much. Two touchdowns in this game pretty much puts it away. With the uh, shortness of time of the quarter. One good defensive stop is all he needs. However, it looks like Smith oh will manage goodness. the first down. Smith just busting through. Robert Smith. <laughs> Robert, the rocket radio Robert. Call the pepper, drops back, fades to his right, and trips. I fart in your general direction. You mock me on die. <laughs> <laughs> all right, now we're mixing many too many races. Uh, all of a sudden. Oh, pepper. Heath, the candy man, oh. trying to bust in, but doesn't get there Jordan. in time. And instead, Vikes get a first down. Cole Pepper playing well under fire. Three for four for 36 yards. He's uh, having a pretty good afternoon thus far. Well, Pepper looking, dropping, passing, four for five, 40 some yards. Smith picks up that carry, or that catch. Seven plays for 43 yards. Well, Pepper drops back I again. I quote He's the Cincy coach. I oh, wow. Still Jordan makes the ass. catch. He's down at the 15, 14 yard line. 56 seconds left in the half. The it's Vikings uh, call timeout. They are threatening. Definitely threatening. Looks like they want to conserve some clock time so they can onside kick and get two touchdowns to end this quarter. <laughs> it just <laughs> might happen. <laughs> <laughs> the computer's just ruthless in this game. Yeah, it looks like Culpepper behind the center. He's got quite the ass. Not quite a snap. Culpepper looking to fire. Looks, Plenty of time. turns, oh. crumpler. Who the hell is Crumpler? <laughs> Crumpler uh, catches the touchdown. I've sounds never like heard of one him. of the enemies of James Bond or something. <laughs> oh my God, it's the Crumpler. <laughs> <laughs> one of the missing mystery men, I guess. Elvira Crumpler catches the touchdown. <laughs> and uh, it's the Vikings answer. Punky Brewster makes the kick. It's all good. 14 yards. Culpepper's been on fire this second drive. 7-7, seven, seven. the score is tied. There's not much time left in this half. And you Ken be Berger looking to kick off. Yeah. <laughs> what are the chances? <laughs> is he still in school, by the way? I mean, he's, <laughs> I have no idea. He's got to be like in his 10th senior year. He's the 10th year right sophomore. <laughs> uh, receiving the kick. Mac. Freddie Mac. He is the crazy Mac daddy making the roundabouts. And, oh. Who's your daddy? 
He may have a stiff arm, but he couldn't keep his uh, body stiff in that when he just laid flat out. He's going to look for a long connection with only 45 seconds left in this half. Smith beside, behind center, drops back, looking deep. Way down, down 40 field. seconds now as they go Keys. completely deep. One-handed circus One catch. catch. Dives into the end zone. That was beautiful. It was, it was incredible right there. That, it 67 yards all on the left side, all the keys. 36 seconds left, and Cincinnati is just looking at the Vikings and going. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <It> makes <laughs> <laughs> They're pretty happy. It makes me really happy that I've created my Lark one player as so. a freaking cornerback. He's someone to <laughs> run down the field and ass wrangle that guy as soon as he goes for the ball. I think I'm going to have some pass interference calls. A lot of rectal wrangling going on here. We've seen Mr. Costello quite a few times. Yeah, he have. seems to be the star player of the team. He's definitely getting more playing time. He's no than, Adam uh, Vinatieri, but, you know. Well, <laughs> who is? Who is? <laughs> oh, my God. Everybody wishes they had a Vinatieri. Vinatieri, or Vinatieri. however yeah. the hell it was pronounced Vinatieri. last year. The hell's his name? Tate, bringing it out. Tate. Rock'em, suck'em, Tate out to the 35. Uh, I don't know. Got me. Actually, I think his name is Tate. 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 He's, he's flaming. Uh, the Culpepper lines up to receive the uh, ball, and is uh, is he actually stroking the center scrotum with his thumbs? I think it's a little. That's bigger. that's what the penalty was. There was there was scrotal stroking going on. I there. think there was also some ass penetration. Scrotal stroking. Ooh, five offside. yards. Uh, the offense foolish, jumped offside. Foolish accident by the offense. Look at Denny Green. He's uh, skinnier in this game than he is in real life. His eyes are doing that weird lizard thing, too. I don't know what the hell's going on with these people. <laughs> they made the Minnesota uh, very strange in this game. Very rare Minnesotan football lizards. <laughs> Culpepper <laughs> and the shotgun. He likes it in that position. Well, he, he knows that uh, if he doesn't make this play, he's going to be looking down the wrong end of the shotgun. Ooh, oh Moss catches goodness. the pass. Rampage. There's also a penalty. I think it's going to be roughing the passer. Maybe oh. not. Face mask. Oh. Number 21. Face masking penalty. Uh, Key's not too happy about that call. <laughs> Didn't agree with it at all. Nonetheless, it looks like uh, Paul Pepper is uh, moving his team downfield with only 27 right. seconds left. They could make it the field goal range. He's already thrown for 94 yards and a touchdown, and he is 7 for 8. Quite the uh, throwing percentage there. Keys has not been able to figure out how to stop this Minnesota pass attack. Ooh, almost intercepted. That uh, just as I spoke a little too soon. Oh, Pepper almost threw an interception right over the center. Bringing up a second and 10 with 24 seconds left. They need to get about 20 yards to make it into field goal. Well, 15 yards to make it into reasonable field goal pos position as they have the ball on the 46 yard line of the Bungles. Culpepper in shotgun. Receives the uh, snap anytime, sometime today. Throws. Moss. Reception. Timeout. And that picks up a first down as they make it to, well, that's a 50 yard field goal right now. Uh, but they do have 19 seconds left. And now we'll have a chance to get a little closer for this field goal. Moss has already made quite a few catches today. Culpepper drops back, fires. Carter catches first down on the 20. Timeout. They are marching. He got a little closer because he's not shy. With 14 seconds left, do they have another timeout left? No? I guess they are lining up for the kick the with kick 14 seconds left. Mm. This will be about a 37-yard field goal. I, I would be surprised if Cincinnati didn't Boom. Uh, return this. It's up. It's good. Mitch Booger. Really oh, no, that's Gary Anderson. Left. My he does kick boogers. Yeah, let's see if they'll go for the onside kick here. Kenny might decide he doesn't want to kick it that deep. With uh, 10 seconds left in the second half, will Keys be able to score one more time? Yeah. Uh, I don't know. 10 seconds is an awful lot of time in this game. Well, this is the most effective scoring time for the San Diego Chargers when Griffin Keys plays. Catches with them. the ball, says. <laughs> 
run back. So you, you you know this is a dangerous time for any teams scored by Keys or uh, coached by Keys. Right. The last moments of a quarter. Yeah, <laughs> this is true. <laughs> <laughs> you never know. <laughs> Achilles Smith drops back. He's looking for Keys down the left side. He's going. He is going deep like my dad. Again, the one-handed grab and a touchdown. Twenty-one to ten. That weird, I'm going to crank my chest up now sort of thing there. Good God. That's a, that that might be the offense to stop right there. Yeah, like Prince said, he's a sexy motherfucker. Yeah, that's a, he's obviously got that play down pat. Because he repetitively does the exact same thing. It looks like my <laughs> tight end across Lord the center so. play last year. It was oh so effective for so long. Yeah. I had, uh. Mitch Ben Coates had more yardage in that game than he's had his whole life. So at the end of the uh, second quarter, going into halftime, the Bengals up 21 to 10. The offense, all passing yards for uh, pretty much both teams. There are 47 yards, the very first touchdown of the game by the Bengals. But other than that, it's pretty much been an, an offensive front, except for the fact that the Bengals have managed to score on one play damn near every time they've had the ball. <laughs> Yeah, all in all, it's been a very evenly matched game. It's just that, uh, <laughs> well, <laughs> they're not getting scored on by Neil O'Donnell this time. <laughs> so we'll be moving into the third quarter. Yeah, I think they're going to sub Neil O'Donnell for uh, Culpepper here in the second half. <laughs> He's going to guide them to a comeback victory. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> He's going to not only kick the ball off, but return it. Be the wide receiver, the running back. Mack, here he comes out of his own end. Oh, my he gets goodness. Up ended. I don't think he actually has any ankles left. I think he was actually shorn off right at the point. Shorn foot. off. <laughs> you like that? I, I can use farmer terminology once in a while. He's chilling. He's willing. He's illing. He's Corey Dillon. Well, we have uh, seen the uh, offense of... Cincinnati twice now throw the deep ball. The same guy down the left side. Will he do it again? Oh, and now he's going over the center down to the McGee. McGee. Tony McGee, the tight end, pices nice, one up. Nice little game going on there. Yeah, every time the uh, Cincinnati guys make a catch, they have to do it one-handed. What is up with that? Oh. <laughs> Coach Keys does not allow them. Dylan. Dylan deciding he can't catch with one hand this My time because God. it's a run. And damn. This offense is just dangerous. That's some yardage. It's getting crazy here. This game could get well out of control. One more touchdown. It's going to be 28 10, and this game is done over. Once again, this game is an offensive production. This is the end. Dylan, Dylan once again. breaks a tackle. Rumbling, bumbling. But Someone it's can't quite get back to the line of scrimmage. Three rushes for 75 yards. Pashaw. Was. <laughs> Coach Weller decides that's nothing. His team can outdo that any day. Bubba Smith grabbing his throw to the center. Goes back. Short pass to and who the hell is Jim Croce, I think. <laughs> Jim Croce. <laughs> it was a yeah. very good year. <laughs> <laughs> and that, that's an under. Jim, Jim. Jim Croce, a lot bigger and blacker than I remember him from the 60s. Does but he have uh, his cigar is the question. That would be the important factor. What does that say? Keys Peter pointed Cross? out he did have time in a bottle. Is that Chris Cross's brother? <laughs> That's his cousin. Oh, Lorks. Smith drops back, looks, looks, looks. looks. <laughs> Carranza. Carranza. Jumps into Peter Wark's hands. Look at this. Kirk looking around saying, I got my new theme song. Carranza. There it is. The 88. <laughs> Ain't got nothing like this in real life. The wow. Bengals don't bring half this in real life. Though Corey Dillon has had one good game this year. Looks like we might be going for the two-point conversion. What the hell? He's Dillon pushing through. It good is all God. about the Benjamins, baby. It's now 29 to 10. Give that boy a couple bucks. So much for what, what, I th what we had thought we had seen a scoring affair. Yeah, <laughs> all of a sudden. it's uh, Silly us. It's a personal vendetta against the Vikings here. 
Well, the Vikings really are a bunch of cornholers, and uh, you, you just you got to get in and take. Mikey's it gonna have to watch video of this and cry. All right, God. Uh, Rosie Palmer. Palmer once again making the return. Boom! Mr. Wright coming down the middle, but he's not a factor in the nice. fact that Corey's crotch has been stomped. Jesus. The fag cam. This game brought to you by beer. Beer <laughs> brand beer. The best beer that ever got. Oh, Pepper to Smith. Robert. I don't like throwing to his left according to that. Other option, but, uh, he has had a good day despite the score. Well, he's, he's a middleman. What can I say? He's uh, you know all about splitting the middle. He's, uh, he's like Snatch. He's right down the center. <laughs> oh, he's nothing like Snatch. I'll never take a step back. Almost gets intercepted, except for the fact that he plugged the uh, the other team's butt with the ball on that one. Had the suction been enough to take it in, they actually could have run back for a, a couple of yards. And speaking of ass, I will now be using this microphone for the rest of the night. <laughs> I have a personal microphone now. I hope they've been like sanitized thoroughly. <laughs> yeah, you do shoes. like you know heat these up in the microwave <laughs> or something before the game starts. Uh, you do, right? Twelve yeah. seconds left <laughs> on the play clock. Three seconds left in the quarter. It looked like this will be the last Moss. play. Oh, oh, Randy! Somebody had better tackle his silly ass. Oh man, he Randy. wasn't even slowing down. He was going for the the home run on that. He was he was charging towards the three, forty-three foot mark. You just flat out run ya. Boom, boom, boom. Yeah. Boom, 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 boom. Yeah. Boom, boom, boom. Cornerback's just me. Boom, boom. Black Coxa. He's a defenseman. Linebacker. Linebacker. Going for the extra point. No time left on the clock. This is. Uh, and it's up and good. It's 20 minutes. Man, that was to, uh, looking 17. like it got shanked off of the side, too, but it was just in. Just in. Randy Moss has had a pretty good day. He's the holder. Are you actually getting fisted by Brister? Sucks to be you. Well, the Vikings are uh, making some offensive energy here. Felt uh, as Berger looks to kick off here to start the fourth quarter. They've brought it within 12. Uh, Kenneth Copeland, the uh, famous TV preacher, is uh, actually out there right now. He's showing much respect for the possibility <laughs> of this onside kick. Though it's not looking like it's going to happen, but holy cow. Oh, they did right. line up over there. I didn't Somebody even see it. Dorley. Yeah, good, good, good move, Coach Keys. Uh, good thing the announcers don't actually right. coach football because uh, it could be a mess. Smith under center. Oh, I don't think you're going to need to kick the field goal. This Corey time. Dillon all about running oh, until damn. he finds a defender, and then he just, oh, my God. I think he actually passed out. He just hit him, and it was, it was it, the way he went down was incredible. Smith once again looking to stroke the uh, center scrote a little bit and uh, come up with a magic play. Dillon down the center. He is all about splitting it. Oh. Hit it and quit it, lick it and spit it. I don't know. He uh, he's he's going right down the middle and he's taking it to him. We got another first down. We got uh, first and ten on the twenty and it's twenty short yards to the end zone. And we've got one forty four left in the first quarter. Dylan wrapped up about three yards, two yards shy of the first down again. It ain't gonna take long. They're gonna have to actually dream of plays to to, to kill some time on the clock so that the Vikes can't return. Yeah. Because they're really worried about it. Uh -huh. The concern is written all over Key's face. <laughs> yeah. Smith back passing. Ooh. Oh, that was a bullet. The ref the almost Speranza. caught it, but it just did not uh, have. Hold on to that one. Maybe if he took just a little bit off of it. This game also brought to you by. Uh, oh, it'll come in. <laughs> <laughs> having in a other words, my cock. I'm having a mad. It'll moment. come to him. Uh, Smith once again going back. Touch! Oh, hits Carranza Ow. right in the middle, and he's the money man right there. Carranza in the middle. He's having a discussion did, with the uh, did pole. Did he rack. actually lick the the pole pad there? <laughs> he's a pad licker. 
Dude, that is, <laughs> that is so nasty. Oh, goody. Carranza is a pad licker. All of a sudden, <laughs> I, I'm having, like, visions of Dracula on a bad day, and I'm not really excited <laughs> about it. Um, Bats in his pelfrey is getting ready to kick, and it's through. The bungles are way ahead. It's crazy silly ahead going on. 36 now. to 20. 17. 39 seconds eaten up on that scoring drive, showing no respect for the Vikes. Ugh. Costello looking to kick off. Costello, this game's most frequent game player. Onside kick. Because they need to. Reason. No, you know. He's going for the points in a route. They figure if it works for the Eagles, anybody can do it. He's going ahead and taking the onside kick. Dun, 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 dun. Smith recovers. Oh, though. but at what cost? It was a Smith sandwich in there. There were crazy amounts of defensemen there, or offensemen, or <laughs> never mind. A Randy Smith sandwich. <laughs> Five roast beef sandwiches. Five ninety nine. <laughs> <laughs> wow, has anyone seen the Ray Charles commercials for Arby's by any chance? Uh, no, I haven't. I <laughs> <laughs> Just curious. <laughs> it's almost as stupid as Steve Wonder using one foot the cam camera. Smith, that was a hell of a play, even if he doesn't gain any yardage. <laughs> <laughs> Culpepper all about the left side on this game. He's he's really pushing that way now. Spikes the ball. Wow, they of even have that. Of course, game. in a twelve-minute game, you don't get to spread out your passes all that much. You no. uh, tend to go to your intended receiver all the time. Culpepper's having a good game overall. Two touchdowns, 12 for 16, damn near 200 yards. Well, again, 200 yards in a 12-minute game. That's, that's, that's all right. Well, yeah, that's what I'm saying. Culpepper cocks back. Damn, Carter with the reception on the 22. Cox to Carter. <laughs> Carter, mommy. Um, sorry, abstract reference. Nobody ever saw Bulletproof. I'm the only one who owns a copy of it. Anyway. This game also being brought to you by Dave's Insanity Hot Sauce, which mm. Matt found out was uh, rather warm. Yes, it actually says really fucking hot right <laughs> on the label. Uh. <laughs> the hottest sauce yeah. on the face of the In planet. In case you were wondering, it's warm. Yes. Have you got to try any more of that since I gave you You know product? what? I made some chili about three weeks after we uh, parted company. and <laughs> Chili? No, it was spaghetti. I, I cooked a pound of meat, a lot of meat. I, I cooked a pound of meat, a pound of spaghetti. There was a lot of shit going on in there. There was, uh, touchdown. Oh no! Not that it's gonna matter, yeah, but it little, will become uh, thirty-nine Super to Bowl twenty-four. Going on there, but they're gonna have to get like three onside kicks to make this a real game. Oh, but anyway, I'm talking like two jars of sauce, a pound of spaghetti, a pound of meat. There was a lot of shit going in there. I put two drops of sauce <laughs> in there, and you could taste it all the way through that motherfucker. <laughs> It wasn't flaming hot, but every now and then you got the spice, but you could taste it everywhere in that thing. I'm telling you. That was a whole crock pot full of shit, and two drops made all the difference. It was. Dave's insanity does not fuck yeah, around. It was amazing stuff. You put stuff. a teaspoon in something, and you are done. <laughs> it is the hottest stuff on the face of the fucking planet. Mm. Like on for the extra point. It looks good this time. No shanking going on. Yeah, we... 24 to 36. Highest scoring man in the NFL still, isn't he? Gary Anderson? Yep. I'd have to say. He, he had the lead pretty strong when he was still with the Steelers, and he's put on another yeah, four yeah, years. he just broke the all-time scoring record. The all-time, but he, yeah. he was the leading point scorer in the NFL for, for years when he was still Oh, yeah. Pittsburgh. And now he's the all-time leading point scorer. As he broke Bland's record earlier this season. Yeah, he had one gimpy year when they switched the balls on him, but uh, after that, uh, he's, he's brought yeah, it right back. Well, oh, you know, you get used to a lefty, and you know, all of a sudden you got to convert. It's a whole one different corner. position. Carranza. Carranza. <laughs> circus catch Dude, he's on the fucking money. Yard line. Oh, my goodness. He don't drop shit. Man, I hate the Bengals, but they're looking really sharp right here. Looking to put 40-some points. What? Oh, jeez. Carranza failing to drag a foot. Bah. Disappointed. I thought you uh, would do better than that there, Keith. Let's see if we can. Put it right on the four. Bing. Oh, oh, yeah. Second foot was out of bounds. You got to learn to drag, brother. 
couldn't get that second foot down. Even if you gotta, you know, slop your schlong out there and drag yeah. that behind you. Yeah. <laughs> Bubba Cornholer Smith. That looks like that. Wow. The uh, overlay. Oh my! Oh, oh he, my! Uh, thought he had it. McGee thought he had it, but uh, just couldn't quite come up with it. Ooh. It, it was good enough for me, <laughs> a but obviously iciness. not good enough for Bobby McGee. Smith uh, going ahead to take the uh, ball again. Smith is all about grabbing balls. <laughs> Looks like he's going to go to Warwick, and he one does. Fucking foot. Oh. The runs are just flipping out at the end of the field. I don't know. There was, that was some silly jump, shit. Jump, jump. Daddy Mac will make it. <laughs> are we, we are looking at fourth and 15. He's got to go end zone on this, baby. With 12 seconds left in the game. He's looking to uh, put this one completely out oh, That's worse. Out of that's reach. like fourth and 19. He's got a – oh, Carranza going the deep route, looking good. And wow. there it is. Oh, Busts oh. his way into the end zone. It's crazy. Crazy. 42 to 24. Right. And looking for one more. And four <laughs> seconds left in the clock. It's it's a four-a-fest going on here. Dylan looking for two. <laughs> Dylan. Because, you there. know, we needed two points. Uh, oh, we did get it. It didn't look like he made it in. But amazing. 44, 44 to 24. To 24. <laughs> the Bengals have effectively, uh, well, I, all I can say is the bikes the are scores. actually crying. There is actually crying going on on the sidelines. Going for an outside kick for some odd reason. Costello. They have a player named Costello? <laughs> Craziness. <laughs> anyway, right down the center. Burrow gets railed by Griffin. <laughs> Two seconds left. They need the 22-point uh, play to tie the game <laughs> to go ahead. Were this MV, uh, MTV rock and jock football, they might be able to pull it off, but uh, I don't think this is actually going to happen. Color me crazy. I think they're going the deep route down the left side. That that seems to be the one that's been working for him so far, and I wouldn't be surprised. There it is. Randy Big Daddy Moss. Not deep enough. That's the end of the game, ladies and gents. And what is he pissed off the about? Bengals seems pissed even when the game's over. Coach needs to start taking his Prozac. Points. He doesn't even realize who won the fucking game. He's out there shaking the fat man's hand thinking he lost. Okay, well, the stats should read pretty uh, much big offensive game. As much as the Vikings did outpass the Bungles, the rushing game wasn't close. The Bungles almost had 100 yards. Total offense, they had them by about 70 yards. Uh, first downs, most definitely in favor of the Vikings because the Bengals really only took one play for each score. And uh, total yardage in favor of the Bengals by about exactly 80 yards. Well, that was the biggest offensive game of the series so far. I think that was Key's revenge on the Vikings. And this will be signing off. Looking for our next game in just a few.